Hi everyone, I'm Sarah with Fisher Price Ranch. First off, hit that subscription button down below for updates on our next videos. Um, I would like to do a quick reminder. We had our contest winner and they have not yet responded. Um, so I'm going to give you a couple more days. Um, I'm going to say till the end of Thursday at 5 p.m. If I haven't heard from you, I'm going to redraw a winner. So please get a hold of me. You have to look at the video that was labeled New Buck Pen to see who the winner is. I only had 14 people enter the contest, so not very many. But uh, I need you to tell me that you want him and that you're going to come and get him. So if not, by Thursday at 5 p.m., I'm going to do a new drawing. Alright, so I just want to do a quick update and show you what our next project is. Kind of old slash new project. Um, but our pastures, it's finally warm out. It's actually quite hot. Um, I think it's in the upper seventies today. Um, so our grass is finally starting to really enjoy the warmer weather in our pasture and it's starting to come in. So let me show you guys. All right. So this is the pasture that we got to, um, actually it went really well. We were able to spread the seed and we got everything to stay put even with all the wind that we've had um so it's hard to see but there is grass everywhere and i would say it's maybe two inches tall um so now that it's coming in really well i've been watering it every other day uh, we're gonna work on redoing our other pasture so what i've been doing is as i'm cleaning the goat pen um I'm putting all the manure in a big old pile over here, and I think we might finally have enough that I can spread seed. So I've got all this manure that's piled in here. I've got another pile up top. So we're going to, I've been waiting for a day um, where we don't have a lot of wind because it's just pain in the butt to spread seed and work in the wind. So it's looking like maybe this, this evening I might be able to get it done. So see, we've got another pile of manure over here, but um, you can see we didn't get any grass. We got some weeds that came up. Around this trees here, we got a little bit of grass, and that was all that, that stuck. Everything else blew away. So with all this manure that we've got, we're going to spread the seed, cover it with the manure, like we did the other pasture, and we'll just water it every day and hope that we can get this one growing in. Now that the weather's warm, it should grow in pretty fast. Um, I'll show you the other pasture up top. You can see a lot of grass in this one. So I'm hoping within a couple of weeks, we should hopefully be able to let the goats in here to start grazing. Um, so yeah, we need to get this pasture done. And then once these are growing in real good, I can start working on that pasture there. I'm also working in the buck pen. I'm starting to save their manure. And uh, we'll get their pastures working as well. More grass. So we had, there's grass all over this pasture. It's just really hard to see. Um, I don't know if getting lower, yeah, maybe you can see it a little bit better. You can see the green over there. And it's green everywhere. It's just really hard to see because it's little, fine little hairs of grass that are coming in. So anyway, it's definitely getting green. We're very excited about that. Can't wait to get the goats out here. Everybody's just kind of lounging today. We've still got three more goats that are going to new homes. She's going to get butchered soon. And I've still got one left that's looking for a home. And that's her in the feeder there. Tipsy Fiddler. 100% New Zealand Kiko dough. But, uh, yeah, it's going to be pretty empty over here. This is everybody. Um, good news is, is Brownie, as you could tell, is getting quite fat. She is due in two weeks and two days. So I'm very, very excited. Um, if you've seen us um, in some of our previous videos quite a few months ago, um, she would not breed. She wouldn't take... Um, so we treated her for ovarian cyst, and obviously that had to be the cause because now she's finally pregnant. It's been been trying to get 
kids out of her for almost 16 months. So I'm very excited. I cannot wait to see these kids. I'm really hoping she gives me a girl. But, uh. All right, guys. So just a quick short video, just an update. And uh, last reminder, please, the winner of the goat, um, you need to contact me by Thursday at 5 p.m. Or I will do a redraw and we will find somebody else who will take him. All right. We'll see you guys next time.